Welcome to your first diary session. Thank you. How does it feel to be in Big Brother's house? Amazing. Um, yeah, I feel, I feel, I feel good. I feel, I feel good. I feel amazing. Yeah. And what has the experience been like for you? Um, still adapting, um, but it's more than like the house is beautiful, like everyone's amazing, we're all getting along still. So yeah, we're, we're, all, we're all happy I think for now. And what are your thoughts? about your fellow housemates? Honestly, I feel like we're all, I feel like we're really mature. This is my, I might be wrong, but I think we're all really mature and like we like each other. So it's working, like we have quite similar experiences. There's a lot of, you know, talented and like experienced individuals in the house as well. So. But mostly I think we're really mature that we're bonding and we respect in each other. I mean, it's only been day two. Day one, day two, yeah, day two. But I think we're respecting each other as we should. And everyone has a story to tell, so yeah, we, um, I'm loving it. And who do you see yourself bonding with? Hmm. I'm still doing that. Um, um, I'm still doing that, I'm not going to lie, I, I'm talking to everyone and I like everyone and I know I can't like everyone but it's still day two so I can't really take it for like certain like oh I know you yet to say I'm bonding with you but the guys are really nice in the sense like oh I feel like home like not home but like they're nice, they're nice guys, so obviously it's comfortable for me and that, that was something I wasn't quite sure of, but I'm comfortable with them. Um, and the girls are equally like super nice, so I can't really say for now who I'm like proper bonding with, but, and I can't say everyone either, so yeah, we'll see. Maria. Yes, big brother. Before you entered Big Brother's house, you were in isolation for a few weeks. That's correct. Tell Big Brother about that experience. <laughs> no, um... Oh my god, um, it was a lot. It was a lot, I'm not gonna lie. Naturally, I'm not even in, like a social media person, like constantly being on my phone, so it wasn't social media at all. It was just not being able to walk around, you know, either from the kitchen to the living room to my bedroom. It was just like, it was hard. I'm not going to lie, it was hard. Um, did I get to know myself? No, because <laughs> I think I was just like trying to get out. Oh my God, I can't wait to get out. And I did a lot of thinking though, but like I wouldn't say I got to, it made me get to know myself more. It didn't. It was just. It was, it was torturing. I think that's the word I'm going to use. I felt tortured, but it was a great experience, I'm not going to lie. Not having to know what time it was, not having to know, you know, what's happening next. Am I going home? And you guys are doing a series of COVID, so I kept being scared. But in all, like, honestly, it's an experience. And will I ever do that, that isolation experience again? Probably not, but I'm glad I went through it because... I think it made me appreciate what what's going on right now. Like I'm amazed to see human beings. Like I love everyone. I think for now, um, and hopefully it just carries on. But yeah, it makes me appreciate the opportunity I have now. You know, I'm able to walk out to the garden. I'm able to like talk to people, cook, eat. Yeah, I appreciate this because of that. Yeah. And would you like to discuss anything else with Big Brother? 
Thanks. Take care.